Hey guys, it's Laura. I'm in my uh, potting shed today. It's a super windy day out. And I have just a quick and easy project to share with you guys. In fact, you might laugh at me because it's so simple. I don't know, I'm, but I'm gonna show you, so here we go. I had an extra succulent left over from the project I worked on um, with the leaf and clay succulents over the weekend, and I'm gonna be using this beautiful uh, Haworthia African Pearl succulent. First of all, here's the supplies that you need. I'm gonna make a little terracotta pumpkin, and that succulent is gonna be the pumpkin stem. Okay, so just a little uh, plastic or terracotta, whatever, saucer for a pot a little bit of hay, a terracotta pot or plastic pot in a terracotta color so it can kind of look like a pumpkin, uh, a pencil, and a black Sharpie, and some cactus mix. Okay, so basically I just sketched out a pumpkin face on here, a happy little pumpkin face with a pencil and it's great because you can erase right on here if you make a mistake. I'm gonna fill it in now with a Sharpie and then I'm gonna show you what it looks like. You could take it to a whole new level and draw little spiders or webs and all sorts of things on here, but I am going to keep it simple because that is my comfort zone right now. But see, cute little pumpkin face. Okay, so now I'm just going to grab some Espoma cactus mix and fill this up. simplest thing ever, right? Okay, so then I'm just gonna take the uh, succulent here. I'm gonna make a little hole for it for the roots there. I think I'm gonna add a little bit more soil. And that, in a nutshell, is it. Something just super fun to do with the kids. Something fun to do for yourself. You can get as creative as you want. I just thought that this was super cute. I might come along and put some like moss on top there. Okay, so knowing me, as I do, I knew I was not satisfied with that top having just the stem. So what I did was I just pulled out a couple little pieces of Creeping Jenny from a planter that I had and popped them in there kind of to look like little pumpkin vines coming down. And then I had some faux candy corn that I placed in here. Uh, so you've got like the little straw pieces and the little faux candy corn and the succulent in the middle for a stem and then some Creeping Jenny just coming down. And anyone that has grown Creeping Jenny knows if you have that plant, you have plenty of it. It is very abundant and very spreading. So just a cute little accent here up our stairway. And there's the succulent planters that I did the video of the other day and they are looking great. Just a fun little project for the family. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great day.